Accessing Schedule Assistant. Starting from my.fsu.edu, select the Student Central icon. Next, on your student homepage, select the My Classes tile. Next, on the left side of the My Classes page, select the link for Schedule Assistant. Then select the button in the center of the page that says Open Schedule Assistant. Disengage any pop-up blockers for this page if necessary. Now select the term you want to plan, then select Save and Continue. Setting your filters. On the Build Schedule tab, review the filters at the top of the page. Course status, select Open Classes Only to see currently available courses. Campuses, select the campus that aligns with your main campus location. Careers, select Undergraduate. Term, select the term you want to plan. Sessions, select the appropriate session for the term you are planning. For summer terms, you should select A, for six weeks, B, second six week, or C, 12 week. Searching for courses by subject and course number. Select the Add Course button to begin searching for courses. Use the By Subject tab to search for a specific course by subject, prefix, and course number. You'll find the course prefix in the subject dropdown and the course number in the course dropdown. Review the course description and select the Add Course button. You can view the list of all courses added to your plan in the courses list on the right side of the screen. Repeat this process for any remaining classes. Searching for courses by liberal studies requirements. Select the Search by Liberal Studies tab. Select the Attribute dropdown to find courses that meet general education requirements or graduation requirements. You can select multiple options. Next, select the Value dropdown to choose the correct categories. You can select multiple options here as well. For example, if you're searching for a Gen Ed History that also meets a diversity requirement, select General Education Area and Diversity in the Attribute dropdown and select General Education Area History and Diversity in the Value dropdown. Select the Course dropdown to view the available courses that meet all chosen requirements. Adding a Freshman Interest Group. Select the Freshman Interest Group tab. Only first time in college students registering for their first fall semester will see this. On this page, use the Freshman Interest Group dropdown to review the list of FIGs available. Select one from the list to review the included courses and schedule for the FIG. When you are satisfied, select the Add Course button. Reviewing Course Section. Select the Sections button beside a course to review open sections of the course. Pay close attention to any courses that have a reserve cap you don't qualify for or physical location outside of your main location, as you won't be able to register for those. Deselect any sections you can't or don't want to register for. Select the blue eye icon for each section to see additional details, such as the delivery method, course prerequisites, and any textbooks required. After you finish reviewing the section, select Save and Close to go back to the Build Schedule tab. Repeat this for all of the courses in your courses list. Generating and Reviewing Schedules Generating schedules will show you every possible schedule available. Select the View link to view details on that particular schedule. A chart of your classes and a weekly calendar view will appear on the page and allow you to review the schedule. Any classes that are online will not appear on the weekly calendar view. You can also select the padlock icon to lock that section so all schedule options will only feature the section of that course.
This will also reduce the number of schedule options that you have to review. You can use the left and right arrows at the top right of the screen to view other schedule options. Registering for courses. When you're ready to register for a schedule, select the Send to Shopping Cart button. The classes will move to the Shopping Cart tab. You should do a final review of the classes in your cart to make sure there are no reserve caps or physical location issues that will prevent registration. After the final review, select the Register button to enroll in the classes. A registration results page will appear on the screen to confirm if registration was successful. You are successfully registered for any classes that appear beneath the green check mark. These classes will now appear on your current schedule tab. Thank you for watching.